Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Fire Emblem 1. It's your boy Calico Gaming, and you know how we do things around here. Chapter 20 came with the Sable, the Roost Hold. Let's get it. There was General Ordwin, one of the three heroes of the War of Liberation, who put Groost on the map. His peerless knights teamed their neighbors, the barbarians in the kingdom's infancy, securing his place as one of the greatest of the Seven Kingdoms. However, the current king, Ludwig, was weak-willed and easily cowed. The Luna had little trouble forcing him into an alliance. Now he had taken ill even as Gru suffered its string of defeats at the hand of the League. The once mighty kingdom was poised to fall. And that's it, huh? Okay, let's see what we got. We have... We have an arena. I don't think we're gonna utilize it. At all. Um, couple of generals with lances. We have a ballistician. I want to take care of him for sure, for sure. What do we have here? We have a couple of Lancing Paladins, another Ballistician. Interesting. That's going to be rough to get to. And another one, ba another Ballistician right here. Presumably reinforcements right here. What do we have up here? We have a Curate, General, another Ballistician. <laughs> a Thief with the Devil Sword. The general, alright. Alright, so let's go ahead and pick our units and do the inventory management thing, and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Alright, I reckon we're ready, so let's go ahead and do the damn thing, shall we? Yes. Nina, we'll soon be launching the attack. If you have something to tell me, now is the time to do it. Where'd the beat go? All right, Marth, as you wish. When the Deluna Groost allied forces seized control of Akanea, the entire royal family was killed, save me. I was given into Groost's custody, the custody of the Sable Order, to be more specific. I am told the Luna wished for my execution, and with it the end of the holy lineage of House Akanea. And Groost was willing to comply. But you are not dead. That is right. I snitched. I was not put to the sword. The Sable Order's captain came to my defense. His name was Camus. Camus protected me, knowing he risked incurring the wrath of the Shadow Dragon. He was the one who eventually arranged for my escape to Aurelis. I had no idea. That certainly explains the Luna's displeasure with him. I hated him too at first. But in time, I found my hatred tempered by the compensation he showed me. My feelings changed. And now, all I wish is to see him again. But not if it means that you and he must fight. Nina, do you... I cannot make any promises, but I will do what I can. I hope you can accept that. Thank you, Marth. I could not ask for more. Okay, let's see. How are we doing this? I think first and foremost, we select homeboy. We select this. We know what our limits are. I check this. Attack. If I were to say something like this, that's not a kill. If I were to say something like this, that is a definite kill. Okay, so you do four damage to me. This is a worst case scenario. You do 10 damage, so 14 damage to me. Uh, I do something like this, stay in the forest tile. That's a kill, okay. We do that. Oh, it's a crit city bitch, crit, crit city bitch. That's how we start the episode off. All right. I move down, open the bridge. I place wolf, yeah, wolf as bait here. Maybe even both. 
because I have a feeling he's going to prioritize my tankier characters right there. Uh, for the rest of us, I do believe we work down towards that bridge area. Uh, Gordon, you have... I, I tried with you, man, but it's not, it's like not in the cards to develop you any further. <laughs> I just don't see it. Uh, however, I have Bars coming through. He's going to be very important. You can cross the water. So, we might do that. Everything depends on... No. Because I have a feeling I'm going to catch aggro from these four. And I feel like Nabarro would be more useful down here to start with at least. So we have a flying unit here. We have Marth who can't really do anything. But we have you. Okay, so the, the, everything hinges on you being able to take care of this character. Which you cannot. You cannot. Okay. It's good to know. However, Steel Lance or Silver Lance. That's also a problem, but he may do that. He's gonna hit me for three. We're gonna have to take down the chin. Yep. The worst part is the other one is probably going to do somewhere along the lines of 10 damage, maybe. I could place Marth over here, and that would probably cause him to attack Marth instead. Do I wanna do that? Or do I just want to keep it cool? Play it cool? Play it a little bit cool, like so. Okay, so he took the bait. Yep, yep. Nine damage, as expected. He's dead, as expected. They took the bait, as expected. <laughs> So here's the tricky part. Wolf has to retreat, right? Oh. Okay, no, there we go. Okay. Yeah. This was kind of what I was, uh... Not scared of. A little worried about, maybe? Okay, so Silver Sword. We have Silver Sword, Silver Sword. Uh, I could do something along the lines of... Uh, do we have another... We do. We gotta be careful. We gotta be mindful of that. We could do something like this. 48. Uh, let's go ahead and do that. One hit kill. I'm using my wing spear quite uh, liberally now, but hey, it's okay. I, I feel like it's okay. I could do something like this. However, how far can you go? Uh, quite a ways off. But... It's all good. I'm gonna put you in the forest tile right here. Shall we say that? Now, if you hit me, I'm gonna be in a tough spot as far as HP goes, but I feel like it's still gonna be manageable. He hit me, damn it. Okay, so that other guy probably hit me for another 11. You, I kind of need you to fuck off. How about that? Okay. This is the clutch round. How about I say Elfire? We do that. That will work. However, I would like to switch to maybe a Bolganon. Very good. Very good. Very, very good. Next. What you got? We have skill, speed, and luck. Meh, alright, that's fine. That's a standard level, isn't it? Go able. Steel sword, 14. He's gonna do that much to me. Uh, is that okay? Is that okay? I feel like... 15 is gonna do 10 to me. I feel like we can take this risk. That will do. That's a level. We got HP, that's it. Eh, eh. <laughs> not my best. We can do that, it's not going to kill. However, if I do something like this though. 
come on. You are having a fucking giggle minute. He can't reach. That's like the issue. You could. If I do that. One to one. It might hit one to twelve. He, does he have a better weapon? No, it's they are quite similar in what they have. Alright. So this is this is the risky one. This is the risky one. 29% crit chance. I will take that. We get it. That's a crit city bitch. Crit crit city bitch. I like that. Next. Oh, okay. Shit. No, I don't want to do that then. I don't want to do that. Uh, do something like... I'm going to get hit. I don't want that. Listen, this is how we're gonna do this. Boom, get the javelins out. Nice, nice. All right. And then the barrel. Or Dolph, come on. You can do it, family. You got it, you got it. Right? Because if you don't, you're dead. 75%. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I mean, man. Nice. That was a sweaty one, actually. Alright, so in the barrel, do that. The rest of us, I think we're fine. Roger. Okay, what's the move? You go for Merrick? You miss. This is amazing. What do you do? Okay. That works for me. Got the silver sword. Okay, ease up. Where the fuck? Where are you going? <gasps> There's a village here. You're not getting that village on my fucking watch, mate. Somebody then told you wrong. Uh-uh. Wait, that's that's a bad move. That's a better move. That works. Nice. Okay. Next. Well, I kind of want... It's like, can you talk to Kamas? No, you can't. We do. That's the thing. I could, oof, I could rush it, but then she would be in the thick of things, and I don't feel comfortable sending her in there like that. Um, since we have a fort, we might as well utilize it right here. I'm gonna utilize the forest tile right here. Since you are close by, we're gonna do that. But Nabal, you're going to work your way up as well, I suppose. And it goes the same way. Now, the reinforcements here are kind of uh, bothersome here, but we might do something along the lines of that. Barst, I might. I need four units, so Barst might be one of them. Golf might be one of them. Unfortunately, Julian is going to be one of them, unless I bring Gordon with us, but uh, it's like bringing Gordon is a risk. Do that. Frey might be a good one. Because he's weak sauce. Okay, so I feel like Merrick can go up as well. Um, nobody can reach you. Okay. I could do that. I shall. Okay. Very good. Now, the thing is, I think... Is it... I can talk to him. Okay. What do you have? 
right. Okay. I think I do a risky piece of play here and just run here. Out in the open, that's what we're doing. Rest of you, head on down. I have a feeling we're gonna meet up with reinforcements sooner rather than later. And it's just, let's just get into it. Got you. And then, I'm not, I'm not even gonna. Curious about your book. C C C B D. Alright, so that <laughs> It feels like Merrick would gain a lot from having a healing staff and Lena would gain a lot from having a tome. I could do that. I do not wish to. Let's see. Uh if I do that, he's gonna attack me. Right, right. Makes sense. Do this. Do that. Okay. He's gonna take one more step down. Okay. I have a feeling things are gonna get hairy rather fucking soon. Silver last. That's the thing, right? Because if I if I attack him, I'm immediately going to be attacked by you, which I would one shot, but you would get nine damage off on me. Okay, that, okay, that's that's I can work with that. Nine damage, twenty one, and it just so happens to be. Amount of damage. Perfect amount of damage you can inflict on me. I could do something like take care of him. He doesn't double me, right? Or does he? It doesn't matter. Okay. No. Oh, one more time. One more time. Is it? Is it? He, he can't crit me at all. Okay. So I think the play is as follows, right? I do this. I take you out. That's a crit city bitch, crit crit city bitch. That's fine. That's good. That's great. Now, uh oh, General Camus, can you hear me? It is I, Martha Valtea. I must speak with you. Please show yourself, Prince Marth. I am Camus of Groost. General, I have no wish to fight you. You know, this battle is pointless. Surely you must. You are not that dense. So long as Bruce continues to support the Luna's ambitions, it does not matter what I know or think. I am a knight, and I have a duty to fight for my motherland's glory until the very end. But surely, Prince Marth, there is nothing you can do or say. I am partly to your father's murder. Are you a man or not? Draw your sword. Stop! Camus, please. Princess Nina. Nina, what are you doing here and why did you stop the beat? This is the middle of the battlefield. I know, I know. But please, Camus, listen to me. Camus, you gave me back my life. And Marth, he gave me back my kingdom. I do not wish to see the two of you fight. It is... It is unbearable. Please, Camus, fight with us. We need your strength. I need it. I am sorry, princess. What? But Camus? Were my heart my master, I would do exactly as you say. But what sort of knight abandons his kingdom, his king? And now, now when they need him the most. Would you have me toss away the life I have built as if it meant nothing at all? No, Camus, I... 
I don't know. I have lived as a knight and I intend to die as one. There are no other roads left for me to walk. Farewell, my princess. I shall never forget our days together at the palace. Few though they were. I pray you meet someone who can bring joy back into your life. Okay, so... Wait. Okay, good. That motherfucker can't hurt me. Good, 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 good. So, I don't know. I'm not gonna risk it. I don't think Camus can kill me from one. But I'm not sure if I can one-shot him either as Ogma. So, I think... This is the play. Three? I was scared of nothing. With this lance, Gradivis, I am all but invincible. A pity you had to waste your life. Wait, you can do that from distance? Holy shit, I did not, I, I did not catch that at all. Holy shit, he would have fucking murdered me, dude. 100%, boom, boom, boom. This is the play. Nina, farewell. Nobody else can harm me. Only a luck, all right. A Gradivius, I can use that. So, I intend to. A Dragon Pike against Manakeets. I only have five uses out of this. Um, yeah, okay, you, you got to go. I'm sorry. Now, that changes things a little bit. How about if I do something like... I can't do that. <laughs> I shall do this though. No, why did I do that? Doesn't really matter, does it? Wait, what am I doing? Oh, I am stupid. Stupid. <laughs> oh no, this is bad. Well, I have to... Fucking hell. Alright. Good job. Good job, team. This is... <sighs> Why did I do that? Why did I do that? There was no need for me to do this. Then there's another fucking fort here. I guess Julian can take care of that. Uh, but my beef is... Just... Let me, I mean, I'm gonna show you what my beef is. So you go from the bar, 30% chance to hit. You miss. Good, great, awesome. Bro, <laughs> Could we please sort our fucking lives out? This motherfucker was about to do it. Die. Is he going to kill himself? Nope, it's a crit city bitch, crit crit city bitch. Nice. Send that shit immediately. Well, you see, the thing with Marth is, he kind of has to <laughs> trick back now. You, uh. about you do that you work on your axe skills well done you lovely send that to the convoy baby all right If only we had another Master Seal, that would have been great. But the game plan is something along the lines of... Uh, I don't understand, like, aren't we supposed to get reinforcements here? Am I bugging? Seven. Okay. Oh my god, then you have to trick back to seize the fucking thing, don't you? Jesus. Well... Do that, do this. 
covered. Uh, that would, that's gonna suck. Unless... Yeah, no, I'm not gonna move an inch. Do that, do that, do that. That will do. That will do. Okay. Keep on trekking. There it is. Ah, oh, Prince Moth. Welcome, welcome. Tell me, have you seen my granddaughter, Lena? Is she well? If she happens to be with you, would you see that she gets this hammer and staff? It's a staff of repairing passed down through our family. I am certain she will make good use of it. Of course, not all items can be repaired. Be sure to caution her about that. Alright, sweet. We need that, I guess. For Lena only. Okay. Now, <laughs> this fucking trick back starts. Uh, let's do that. Then I guess we can take this route. Really? No reinforcements? Interesting. Okay. So you made it back. That's not bad. All right. What do you have? Silver Lance, so... Basically, you are screwed, my good sir. It's a crit city bitch, crit crit city bitch! Nice. Um... Nine... I mean... Sixteen, no crit. No, wait, 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 wait. Shit the fucking bed. I almost pulled the trigger on this motherfucker right here. Let's talk to you. General Lorenz, my name is Shida. I hail from Talis. My father has told me quite a bit about you. Princess Shida, my. Look at what a lovely young woman you've grown into. Your father was a good friend to me many years ago. General, I heard you oppose Groose forming an alliance with the Luna. Why didn't you try to stop it? You think I did not try, Princess? Our king is meek. In the end, the Luna proved better at cowing him than I did. But sir, surely you know that the Luna intends to use the Manichaeans to conquer humankind. You must act now for Groose's sake, if not the world's. Join us, General Lorenz. We can put an end to this battle right now. Hmm. What you say makes sense enough, but I serve Roost. I cannot simply betray my country. Ah, but what makes a country? Pardon? Is it one man, your king? Or is it the countless innocent people who make their home here? Well, that's... My father has a saying. A kingless country is a country still, but a king without subjects rules naught but hills. If you disobey your king to ensure his subjects' safety, how is that a betrayal? You are protecting his reign. Protecting his reign? <laughs> ah, that mad logic. I feel as though I've shed 20 years and I'm talking to your father again. You win, princess. I yield. I will join you in the interest of king and country. Arr! Gucci, great, awesome. Prince Marth, I am General Lorenz of Groost. I have decided to join you in the interest of my fellow Groostians. I am honored, General. Thank you. Shida tells me you and her father were close. Yes. How oh, the princess has grown, though. Sharp as attack, that one. Such a change from when she was... Uh, no, what was I saying? What am I saying here? Shida has always been clever. That's all I was trying to say. And even as a wee girl, she knew how to wrap her elders around her little finger. 
You knew Shida when she was little? Oh yes, the mischief she got into. Whoop! Well, those are stories for another day. First, we have a battle to finish. So we do, sir. Forgive me, Nina. I was unable to reunite you with your general. No, Marth. I... I should not have made such a selfish request. I am sorry. So, so terribly sorry. The worst part, Marth. The worst part is... I knew it would come to this. Ever since I gave you the emblem, I just knew. Have you heard the story of Artemis' curse? No. The last time the Fire Emblem changed hands to serve House of Kanea, it was not without cost. There was a princess named Artemis, who loved your ancestor Anri with all her heart. He loved her as well. But when Medeas appeared, the two were parted forever. She cursed the Fire Emblem, called it the end of the war, but also the end of love. Now the emblem has changed hands again, and I am the one who is cursed. Nina. Look at me, so quick to fall apart. You lost loved ones in Altea and took it so bravely. But I cannot be so brave. Please, leave me for a moment. This is too much to bear. I need to... I need to confront my feelings. Say no more, Nina. Princess, I will step out. Send for me if you need anything. Thank you, Marth. Ah, uh, Kamas, Kamas. Ah, uh, no. Oh, my. Alright, and that was chapter 20. Next episode, we're going to tackle chapter 21. This has been your boy, Kyrgyz Gaming. I'm out of here. Love y'all and do says.